What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how you can do your own oil change very quickly on an all-wheel drive Honda Pilot Touring from year 2016 all the way to 2020 and I'm going to show you all the steps and all the tools you need. Here you go. First things first, pop the hood and after you secure it, you look for your dipstick. It is bright orange, you cannot miss it, you're going to need it to check your oil level. Next thing you do is you take the cap off. I have to use my phone flashlight so you could see it better and you take it off and before we continue let me show you what you're gonna need obviously the oil for this car it's 0w20 so I have five quarts plus one makes it six quarts and I'm gonna add 5.7 after I drain it out clean uh, um, paper towel gloves of course a funnel in fact let's put the funnel in there right there let's put it there you're gonna need a filter wrench you need a ratchet right here and a 17 millimeter socket and of course an oil pan so we could drain our oil right there it says engine oil as you can see and there's an arrow that guides you right here make sure that the pan is at a certain angle so when you drain the oil so it could go from from here directly to the pan there we go When you loose it, now you can take it out with your hand, just like this, and you let the oil drain. Just let it drain, and we'll be back. Remember to always change the gasket. This one right here, this right here is the old one, so I put a new one there. And now let's go put it back now that it has been drained make sure you wipe it off and then uh, you put the drain plug back in there you don't need to force it it should go nice and easy then you grab your ratchet again and tie it up That's enough. And for our next step, we're gonna remove the uh, oil filter. You're gonna need your filter wrench. And for this particular one, it's really easy to get access to it if you turn your passenger tire to the right, okay? Or you could always go underneath again, but I'm just gonna show you uh, the easier way. See, right on it. Turn left to loose it up. Boom, it's already loose, so now I can do the rest with my own hand. And what I like to do is put some oil on the new gasket on the new filter. When you uh taking it out next time, it will make it easier. Make sure it's all clean and install a new one. It should go back on it very easy again. Make sure it's hand tight. See, once you feel that it got to the engine, you just twist it one turn, or that was half a turn, so another half. Boom, that should be enough. Wipe the new filter so you could check for leaks after you add new oil and start the car. And for this step, all we need to do is add 5.7 quarts. Here we go. And now that we put the oil, we put the cap back on. And now we're gonna start it and check for leaks. Start it up. I like to let it run for like two, three minutes. You know, check if there's any leak. There's no leak here. I turned off the car and now it's time to check the oil level. Grab the dipstick, wipe it off.
it looks full and clean and of course the last step is to reset the maintenance minder and to do that you gotta go to settings you select vehicle and then you go down to maintenance info and then there it is right here I was uh, 193 miles due past due so what you need to do is just hit reset would you like to reset maintenance information you say reset and that's it to verify that you could just start the car and then on your steering wheel you check right here and it's gonna tell you all your life 100% or you could always verify it here as well all your life 100% and you all set if you have gotten any value from this video give me a huge thumbs up leave a comment let me know what you think I'm also here to learn you could give me some tips the best tips come from you of course remember to subscribe I would really appreciate it and I will see you guys on the next one okay wait you're almost done remember to put your used oil on a container and bring them to your local auto parts store they're gonna recycle it or any place that's gonna recycle it because obviously you can keep it at home all right thank you for watching